Hey there, movie aficionados and fellow time travelers. Movie camera sparkles, do you remember those golden days of cinematic enchantment? Back when the screens were not just high definition, but also high on nostalgia. It's time to embark on a journey down memory lane to 1968, when the world was groovy and our hearts were captured by a flying car named Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. I'm curious, did you ever catch a glimpse of this whimsical wonder back in the day? Did you sit on the edge of your seat, eyes glued to the screen, as Karaktakis pots, truly scrumptious, and those delightful pots children took you on an adventure like no other? Or perhaps you couldn't get enough of the dastardly child catcher and his spine-tingling escapades. Let's rewind time together and reminisce about your favorite moments, those characters who felt like old friends, and the magical experiences that Chitty Chitty Bang Bang brought into your life. Did the catchy tunes and incredible inventions leave an indelible mark on your imagination? Share your cherished memories with us, for after all, movies are made to be shared and cherished. Now, without further ado, let's fasten our seatbelts and take off into the enchanting world of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, as I unravel some intriguing and random facts about this timeless classic. Buckle up, my friends, because this is going to be a ride to remember. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, a 1968 musical fantasy film, emerged from the creative minds of author Ian Fleming and the iconic film duo, The Sherman Brothers. Set in early 20th century England, the story follows the adventures of the eccentric inventor Karatakis Potts and his family as they embark on a whimsical journey with their extraordinary flying car, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. This imaginative tale, directed by Ken Hughes, seamlessly blends elements of fantasy, adventure, and musical comedy, creating a delightful cinematic experience. The film boasts a memorable cast, including Dick Van Dyke as Karaktakis Potts, Sally Ann Howes as Truly Scrumptious, and Lionel Jeffries as Grandpa Potts. However, the real star of the show is the titular car, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, a beautifully crafted and enchanted automobile that captures the audience's imagination with its ability to fly, float, and even save the day. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang is celebrated for its charming and catchy musical numbers, courtesy of the Sherman Brothers, known for their work on Disney classics. The film's iconic songs, such as Chitty Chitty Bang Bang and Truly Scrumptious, have endured as beloved classics in their own right. This cinematic gem left an indelible mark on popular culture, captivating generations of viewers with its whimsy and creativity. Its influence extends beyond the screen, as Chitty Chitty Bang Bang has become a symbol of imaginative storytelling and a cherished piece of cinematic history. In summary, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang is a delightful and enduring classic that continues to enchant audiences with its charming characters, enchanting music, and timeless sense of adventure. It's a testament to the power of imagination in storytelling, and its impact on popular culture remains significant to this day. The name Chitty Chitty Bang Bang was inspired by a series of actual race cars named Chitty Bang Bang in the early 1920s. These cars were known for using massive aircraft engines. Film producer Albert R. Broccoli, famous for the James Bond films, aimed to replicate the success of Mary Poppins with Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. He enlisted the talents behind Mary Poppins, including songwriters Richard M. Sherman and Robert B. Sherman, musical adapter Erwin Costell, and choreographers Mark Bro and Dee Dee Wood. Broccoli even tried to reunite Dick Van Dyke and Julie Andrews for the film, but Andrews declined. Some view Sally Ann Howe's casting as a Julie Andrews substitute. One of the Chitty Chitty Bang Bang cars is displayed at the National Motor Museum in Beaulieu, England. This iconic film blends racing history and Disney-esque musical charm, making it a timeless classic. In 1968, the movie Chitty Chitty Bang Bang took audiences on a whimsical adventure, but did you know it had some intriguing connections to the world of James Bond and fairy tales? Let's dive into the fascinating details. Ian Fleming's other creation, the original book behind Chitty Chitty Bang Bang was penned by none other than Ian Fleming, the mastermind behind James Bond. Yes, the same Ian Fleming who introduced us to the Suave Spy 7. It's quite a departure from espionage to flying cars and magical adventures. Bond stars in a different role, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang also brought together three actors from James Bond films. Gert Frobe, famous for playing Goldfinger, Desmond Llewellyn, known as Q, and Anna Keel, who had a role in From Russia with Love, all made appearances in this family-friendly flick. 
It's a delightful crossover of talents from the Bond universe. Albert R. Broccoli's unique production. Here's an interesting tidbit. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang stands out as the only non-James Bond film produced by Albert R. Broccoli after he started the Bond series. Broccoli was the driving force behind the Bond franchise from 1962 to 1989, making this adventure into the world of flying cars a unique endeavor for him. A castle fit for a baron, the movie features Baron Bomberst's imposing castle, which might look strangely familiar to some. That's because it's none other than Neuschwanstein Castle, built between 1869 and 1886 for Bavarian King Ludwig II, known as the Mad King of Bavaria. This castle also served as the inspiration for the Sleeping Beauty Castle at Disneyland and the iconic Walt Disney Pictures studio logo. Talk about a majestic setting. So, next time you watch Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, remember the surprising connections it has to James Bond and fairy tale castles. It's a testament to the diverse talents and influences that came together to create this beloved classic. In the 1968 movie Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, there's an interesting connection to James Bond creator Ian Fleming and renowned screenwriter Roald Dahl. While the film was inspired by Fleming's book, it took a different path under Dahl's creative touch. Fleming's chitty story involved the Potts family and their flying motor car rescuing a French candy maker from gangsters led by Joe the Monster. However, the film's story, set in Bulgaria, is entirely a Roald Dahl creation. Dahl introduced his distinctive stock characters and situations into the narrative. He also came up with the character named Truly Scrumptious, which might be a nod to Fleming's penchant for giving his female characters memorable names like Honey Rider, Pussy Galore, and Kissy Suzuki. This collaboration between two literary giants, Fleming and Dahl, resulted in a whimsical and beloved film adaptation that continues to charm audiences with its unique blend of adventure and fantasy. And that's the scoop on the intriguing backstory of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Stay tuned for more fascinating movie trivia. In the 1968 movie Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, the sound of the name Karatakis Potts is intended to resemble crackpot, a term often used to describe a foolish person. This reflects how most of Mr. Potts' neighbors view him in the film as a somewhat eccentric and unconventional inventor. The choice of his name adds a playful touch to his character, emphasizing his unique and imaginative personality. Regarding the director of the film, Ken Hughes, it's worth noting that he had a challenging time working with children on set. Dick Van Dyke and Robert Helpman, two of the lead actors, would often have to remind Hughes to refrain from using strong language in front of the child actors. This suggests that Hughes may have found it difficult to adapt to the presence of young cast members, highlighting the complexities of working with children in the film industry. In terms of the iconic car itself, seven different Chitty Chitty Bang Bang cars were constructed for various purposes during the production of the movie. These included a worn-out version, a restored one, a car designed for flying scenes, another for water scenes, and three partial models used for different scenes throughout the film. This level of detail and effort in creating different versions of the car underscores the importance of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang as a central element of the movie's charm and appeal. In summary, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang incorporated clever wordplay with Carrot Takis Potts' name to reflect his character. Director Ken Hughes faced challenges working with child actors, and the production invested in multiple car versions to bring the iconic Chitty to life on screen. These behind-the-scenes insights offer a deeper appreciation of the 1968 movie and its enduring charm. As we bid adieu to this captivating journey through the whimsical world of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, I invite you to take a moment and reflect on the unique place this cinematic masterpiece holds in your heart. 1968 marked the birth of a timeless tale filled with magic, adventure, and unforgettable characters. The flying car, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, has soared through generations, leaving behind a trail of cherished memories. Perhaps you recall watching it for the first time as a child the wonder in your eyes matching that of the Potts family as they embarked on their fantastical journey. Or maybe you've revisited this classic over the years, discovering new nuances and lessons with each viewing. In a world that seems to change at a dizzying pace, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang remains a steadfast reminder of the power of imagination 
and the enduring appeal of family bonds. It's a film that transports us to a simpler, more magical time, where anything is possible with a sprinkle of pixie dust and a dash of determination. Now, I encourage you to share your treasured memories and thoughts about this enchanting movie. What is it about Chitty Chitty Bang Bang that resonates with you? Is it the catchy tunes, the fantastical inventions, or the heartwarming relationships? Your unique perspective adds to the rich tapestry of experiences woven by fans worldwide. Thank you for joining us on this nostalgic journey. Your time and interest are greatly appreciated, and we look forward to hearing your stories and insights about Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Together, we celebrate a timeless classic that continues to spark joy and wonder in the hearts of all who encounter it. Stay tuned for more delightful adventures and reflections crafted just for you.